welcome to uh, see the installation and uh, full overview of whatsapp chat support uh, you can install in any domain or any place and that link work with uh, any website i will show you uh, the process how it will work you can uh, work with any subdomain or any folder also okay no problem there is no restriction there is the, no requirement you can install any subdomain or any uh, folder no problem i just uh, write create a new folder which is called uh, wjet and i'll upload my files here just drop in file here it is uh, it will upload uh, take few minutes when you see uh, upload is a uh, hundred percent then you close it and reload and you need to unzip the package when you unzip you need to make sure uh, in the setting from the setting show hidden files should be uh, here uh, without uh, show hidden file actually uh, when you uh, copy the files then a hidden file will not copy and that time your system will not work you can't do the installation keep it in mind after reload i just remove this file and make sure dot file is showing here dot env and stxs and others dot file select and move enter the url you will see instantly the installation so our installation procedure is uh, very simple very easy you just extract the file and make sure you move the files at the desired location and you need to make sure uh, show the hidden files otherwise this installation procedure not work properly after click you see all requirement is done i mean all are green no red then go to next step here you need to purchase code when you uh, purchase from the code canyon or directly from us you will receive a purchase code and the email address you need to make sure when you purchase from any application from us that purchase uh, purchase email we uh, register with your purchase code so when you next purchase any product you need to make sure you use same email address because we store actually and button email address where you go to uh, got the and button email ad email address when you purchase any product and but uh, i mean code canyon will send you an email for the download that email actually uh, included integrated with your code canyon so you need to make sure you use the same email after the verification complete now you need to enter the database information so previously uh, you need to create the database info previously installed uh, in your system that time you need to data. if you previously install your uh, system that time you need to uh, tick mark here to remove your previous database but uh, when you install first time that uh, not required to uh, check mark this box you need to enter database information the database information you need to create new database from the mysql database wizard uh, we create a project generate password copy the password save create user make sure give the all privilege make the changes enter the password here and copy this username enter your email address password minimum 8 password uh, 8 character password you need to enter minimum 8 character otherwise system will not install after click uh, you require to stay here if you close this window actually not installed when done just uh, make sure you save your data save the email address and password then go to the home here you need to enter the uh, email address and password
after login your system you will see uh, three menu dashboard system settings and uh, whatsapp chat in the general setting you will found your code where you put the uh, code actually is depend on uh, uh, your url you can use it is uh, any web wordpress website it is uh, use any uh, PSP website even in a HTML website I will show you all three of them uh, you can use any uh, PSP there is no restriction Laravel uh, CI uh, uh, YI or anything else there is no requirement make sure one thing that is you are using HTTP or HTTPS if you are using if you are using uh, HTTP only without HTTPS then uh, your URL uh, also uh, required the same like uh, you install this is your application folder and you want to integrate another uh, website that website need to make sure same URL otherwise system not work so that I just uh, change here HTTPS uh, actually it is uh, HTTPS included so it is take reload and see automatically change the url that means it's dynamically take the url from here so same url need to, need to enter where you install and uh, here is other setting you can change the color from here uh, introduction text welcome text uh, here is the option uh, where is the location position and position padding margin you can change from here here are also two options one is single agent or multi agent if you have single agent then your number is here if you multi agent then uh, this number are not work you need to use uh, insert the agent then it will work so make sure single and uh, multi agent is active or deactive otherwise your system may be not working properly so I uh, right now I show you as a single agent and here is the two option one is uh, pop up instantly I mean when visit the user uh, website that time uh, pop up will automatically open or not and uh, where uh, you want to like uh, sometime mobile app uh, not uh, properly you want to show, uh, uh, show. Uh, that time if you want to uh, show only desktop then you can select here or mobile only that uh, also okay or both and by default we uh, give the both option and here is the another option if uh, as in not I mean not available for the work uh, I mean unavailable that uh, as in uh, list also you want to show or not if you want to show then you can tick mark yes if don't want to show uh, remove here here is the actually bubble logo I mean uh, you see here is the logo so if you want to uh, provide your logo here or any uh, image or picture you want to give here then you can uh, upload from here and here we have a uh, two layout system one is uh, you can see um, bubble logo is uh, top and another one is left side so which one you looks feel better you can use it and we have a language system we have around uh, 170 language so you need to actually translate as per your requirement by default we keep a few of them uh, which is already included uh, like if we um, do the Arabic it will auto translate to the Arabic I just show you here and you move to Arabic to English if anything missing like uh, some uh, word not perfect for you you can go to the translation and you can change your you can select which uh, language you want to translate or change then you can modify here and save it hopefully it will work and here is the update actually we have one click update when you uh, release the new version and then you just uh, click from here and browse the file and click save it will automatically update and here you will see which last update date which day you update it and we have role permission system as we have two user system one is user syst uh, users another is agent user means who will manage the system like uh, you are admin you have the one uh, like 100 uh, agent that you can manage uh, in that uh, scenario you can create some user and give the role permission they can manage or handle the information so when you uh, see the role permission you can create also new role permission as per your requirement so if you go to the user and uh, assign permission you can see the uh, role just click expand you can see 
all of the information then who is role permission you want to uh, provide like you want to user can access the system from the time zone then user login then uh, he can see uh, user can see the time zone also in his uh, panel so this is the role permission system another is a time zone time zone is required because time zone is if not match then it will make the problem uh, we have the option to add your time zone if our database we have added as much as possible but if in case it is missing you can add from here and we have the email setup also for the forget password uh, or something or when user registered we send the automatic email address email and password then you can set up from here uh, by default we active the uh, PSP mail that is a uh, best because it is you can use any email address if your server not uh, any restriction then automatically send the email also you can test your email it is working or not uh, just you can enter email address and uh, test data then send the email if setting is working perfectly then you see test mail successfully sent in the general setting we missed one uh, that is you can change your logo from here and also the favicon here is the favicon and also time zone and the site title and copyright message you can see the copyright here so you can change it here and i show you some uh, user how to create user when you go to the user and uh, you can click the user uh, name and email and role you need to select it is a uh, super admin actually you can give the super admin permission but it is not logical so you can give the user and browser his uh, picture and create the user by default uh, we'll uh, generate the password here is uh, show and for the agent you can create the agent name designation and give the full email uh, phone number like uh, when you enter the phone number you need to make sure uh, plus uh, like country code otherwise uh, system will not work you can see we mentioned here with country code in must and format we uh, this is the standard format we allow and uh, enter the username like uh, we give the name for here and uh, support something and uh, email address and if you uh, browse the email uh, picture you can see from here and here is the option uh, always available uh, active inactive status you can uh, change the date if you want to like uh, give the Sunday working from uh, 9 p.m. to like 12 pin and apply for the all you can see apply for the all day if you want and you need to actually tick mark who is uh, checkbox is working then those day actually show otherwise uh, not showing available and if you update it will uh, done new as in is added i'll show you both of the in other website and analytics actually uh, working for the, uh, your information id ipi from which api which browser user used and operating system also first message not all messages only first message you can see here of our uh, lms system we show you this is uh, developed by laravel i mean based on psp so i'll show you how to integrate this system but first make sure you want to also use the same HTTPS otherwise system not work and let's check it is uh, working with HTTPS so I think this is HTTPS enable so it is working now what we need to do uh, we need to actually go uh, the system I just show you in our uh, application how we uh, manage actually we uh, build this uh, application as a theme base i mean uh, we have a theme system as like wordpress so we need to go front end and in the front end we make the theme name is in fix uh, lms theme and inside the, uh, the lms you need to make sure where you input the, your information if you uh, go to the general setting you will see here is the mention copy this script and paste uh, your website before before body tag ends i mean before close body tag so you need to copy all of the uh, code just click and copy and need to go there 
and make sure actually uh, I use for the front end not back end so I need to go actually uh, the footer the footer and make sure this is the body end and before that you can enter the data in the same we visit the website reload you can see here you can send the message it will work so one things uh, I want to uh, show you that is uh, when it is open like if you uh, if reload the website then it is in the close mode but if you keep it like open update this one reload the website you see by default it is open I will show you more uh, two places uh, WordPress and uh, HTML also here is our one of the uh, nice and beautiful uh, temp HTML template I will show you how to actually uh, work with the HTML template you can use same code not a special code you need to uh, open the index.html actually uh, we call this part uh, from this HTML so I need to click edit and copy the code we need to go to the before body text save reload the page you see it is open I'll show you also in WordPress how uh, you will set up in WordPress. This is the WordPress site you can see. Uh, I log in on the dashboard already. So you need to go to theme editor. And you need to search the footer. So you can uh, find F double O footer. Here is the footer. So here is the you see here is the body closing body tag. You copy that data from here and make sure here the data information and update the file. I hope successfully updated. Now reload the page. You see it is here that means uh, we can work with any PSP any HTML any WordPress so it is universal application and interesting part is uh, one place you can uh, install your application and multiple place you can uh, connect to your uh, information like you have uh, 10 or uh, 20 uh, website where you want to manage from one place then you can use it uh, without any uh, hesitation uh, I hope uh, you get the point. If you face any problem, you can send an email to us uh, in our support email. Thank you very much.